My name is Andrew Coggins, I'm one of the EDA staff specialists here at Westmead. I'm going to do a few minute video here and talk to you about the mechanical autopulse CPR machine. The Zoll Autopulse is a mechanical CPR device that can be used in a variety of situations. Hi, my name is Kevin. I'm a second year medical student uh, doing my MD project. This is the Autopulse machine. It'll be on this trolley, it's movable. The life band will already be set up for you, ready to use on the Autopulse. Over here, we have the weight sensor bar, so that'll sense the patient's weight, so we can calibrate it. Over here, we have the control pens, and you have your power button on top over here. We're going to deploy the auto pulse device, bring the trolley to the patient, remove the device from the trolley, set the patient forward, and using two people, deploy the device behind the patient's back, ensuring the patient's head is at the head end of the device. So over here, we've got the on button. So what we want to do is turn this on. Everything should be set up on the patient before you press the green button. It'll adjust itself and it will start compressing. The autopulse machine can be used in a variety of situations. The primary indications for its use are as follows. Contraindications to the use of the autopulse include trauma, um, as well as paediatric patients. Do not use the device in morbidly obese patients. And avoid using the device in futile situations. Okay, it's hands off. Check rhythm. It looks like VF. Shock delivered. We'll get the auto pulse on now. So first, what uh, we really, we want to do is take the auto pulse machine off the trolley. To do that, we just simply lift this up and take it out.
song. Yeah. I'll let you know when. Close compressions. Either way, check rhythm is VF. Shock delivered, continue compressions.